Just like him, just sub him, it's Yasha Cham 21! What's up YouTubers, today is Yahya Champ 21 I am back with another video How are we all doing today? It is so good to see you guys once again It's been such a long time I've had exams going on and lots of other busy stuff going on But it's great to be back on this channel And we are back with another vlog in Scotland We are in East Renfrewshire for today Just for today guys, we'll be going back to Ayrshire pretty soon So we are vlogging Barhead, which is quite a big place It's a town And I am once again excited to vlog another place with you guys i love doing this it's just my passion because i really think this is just a perfect way to start the vlog well i guess you could say it is pretty quiet a bit of a surprise to me it is a saturday afternoon today but let me just show you this in a closer view we've got a great bridge and then just some trolleys i don't know what that's doing there but as you can see, we just walked around and we just got the nice river ahead of us. But then it just gets better and better as we walk on. And if you don't know who I am, my name is Yahya, aka Yahya Champ 21 on this channel. I vlog places in Scotland, sometimes glue a bit of football content, going to the Johnson Borough games, but I'm mainly on the vlogs in Scotland for this moment. So guys, without further ado, let's get started with this vlog. Let's get vlogging. Here we are at our first destination, Carly Bar Park. Pretty quiet as I just mentioned earlier on. I actually did want to come here first because I have just been walking for about 15 minutes before I started vlogging. Because I just actually just wanted to, you know, relax. I've been on the bus for about an hour, let's just say. But yeah, this is the first place we're going to and it's a perfect one to start off with. Let's just go around and let's have some fun for a bit. That's me done with the park. And I'm gonna be honest with you, it's not the best park out there. Well, if you're somebody who's about six foot just like me, then this is definitely not a park for you. First off, the swings were too low and my feet just kept hitting the ground every time I came down. Second of all, some of the exercise machines and some of the other equipment are just not fully fixed, as you want to say. And number three, it just, may look big but it just is not the best park out there for me if i had to rate it out of 10 i'd give it maybe a four but someone as tall like me that is not the best park to go to now let's go to our next destination Guys, as you can tell right behind me i am at asda i thought i'd pop in for a wee snack and i'll get back to pretty soon Right guys, I thought I would actually just come to Isa just to try these Java Cakes Lemon and Lime. I'm a big fan of Java Cakes, but I've not had the Lemon and Lime ones yet, so I would like to try one for today. Comes in a wee 10 pack. I feel like that's pretty all right. It could be a wee bit better. I just don't think the lime really matches with the Java Cake flavor, but I'll, I'll give that an eight out of 10. Right guys, now we have arrived to the Barhead War Memorial. If you have been watching me for quite a while now, you probably do know that I do vlog War Memorials to show my respect to all those people that fighted. And let's have a look here. Of course, we do have the first one, 1914 to 1918. And most of these do seem to have come from 1914 to 1918. And we also do have the ones from 1935 to 1945. And then we've got a wee message here. 
A set of sins of Blackhead records the pride and grateful remembrance of names for, of those who gave their lives fallen in other conflicts since 1945. But as I do see another place, it doesn't surprise me for them to have a war memorial as most of them would be having one as lots of people did fight in that world war. And let's go to our next destination, which is right next to us. Here we are guys at Cohen Park. And here it is, much bigger than I thought it'd be. We also do see much more equipment and it looks much more enjoyable as you can tell. Overall, you could say that is a better park, in my opinion. But yes, the zip line was my favourite. If we actually go to the park that we went on earlier on, the zip line broke, so there isn't actually one, and that's probably one of my favourite things to do at the park. Anyways, I also have something else to show you that is in this park. For all of you tennis fans, we do have a wee tennis court, which I do find quite interesting for some parks to have which isn't in all the parks we've been to during our journey around Scotland so that is it from the park today so we've been to two parks so far the second one we've just been to is definitely the best one and it is quite a big park overall let's move on to our next destination and I will see you as there As we can see, we've got a wee Cohen Park map. So as you can see, all the tennis courts that we were at were just there. And we've also got the War Memorial that we were at, playgrounds over there. We also have the wee seven aside pitch, which I would like to show you guys next. Also, we do have a wee running track. I'm not sure if people do use this for like actual competitions, but as we can also see over here, we do have Barhead High School. So this could be used for them and they do actually have quite a big area as well which is very good for people who do go to barhead high i would like to have something like this in my school we even have the wee skateboard area scooter etc you've got a space to like go around your bike lots of benches over here and yeah you can just pretty much go for a walk over here right guys we have arrived to a place that most borough fans will remember Yes! 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 That's it, it is Arthur, the team we played a year ago in the West of Scotland Football League. I did not watch the away game, but I did watch the home one where we drew one each. They were a big rival to us. I um, can't remember from the top of my head where they finished, but they were up there. And I do believe they did get promoted. And it is a nice stadium. I'll try to show you a better view from my perspective. As you can see, we've just got the nice stadium. Of course, it's empty because there's no game today, but as you can see, it looks lovely. This is the best I can show you for today. Right, guys, we have arrived to our second last destination. I am going to say this wrong, so I'm going to attempt it. Ferenese Golf Club. I'm probably wrong, but if anyone can comment the pronunciation, then that would be very appreciative. So here we go, we're going to walk up and see what there is to do. Here's a little bit more information, sponsors board. And we just have a bit of bags here. As we keep walking on, it's just the golf course from here. As you can see, there's just a big area, as I've just said just a second ago. And yep, it's just that from here. We also do have a wee small park over here. I'm not going to bother going to it because it does look pretty small. And now that is it from the golf course for today. We will go to our final destination. Here we go. Here was the last destination I wanted to show you is the Barhead Centre. So this is the Carer Centre actually and the reason I can't go on because it's actually shut at the moment. There is also one more place I did want to show you. However, it is closed. The Barhead Co-op 
society fountains which is temporarily closed so yeah that will have to wrap up the video for today i am glad to be back on youtube it's good to see you guys once again make sure to share this video with your friends to let other people know what scotland looks like like the video if you've enjoyed watching it comment if you want to say something about the video and guys make sure to subscribe with the notification bell as you will follow my adventure around scotland Follow the adventure around Scotland. And guys, thanks a lot again. I will see you later. Goodbye. Just like him, just up him, it's Yaka Charm 21.